Hey guys, how's it going? My name's Rob. I just took Kezia's residential course and I'm here to tell you about it. A little bit about what I did, how it went, and overall what I think of it, you know, at the end of these crazy seven days, right? So, I'm not going to try and honestly sell anything to you. I'm not involved in the, the pickup community commercially or anything like that. I'm just honestly a regular guy that came to the course to try and get, you know, a decent girl in my life, a healthy social circle of girls, and just address that aspect of my life. Um, a lot of what I think about it, a lot of where I think you should be thinking and how you should approach the entire situation is that your time and your money are precious, okay? You don't have a lot of that. The fact of the matter is, is that the pickup community is really, really commercialized, okay? They want you to, how can I put it like this? Like I used to do, I didn't do any of the boot camps. Uh, I did some of the products. I couldn't get time off to do the boot camps and stuff like that. But I did a lot of the products and stuff like that. And I had one impression of pickup. And then finally, there was just something that happened in my life where like, you know what, I'm going to set aside time to do this and I'm going to totally go for it. You know, just all my cash in, all in, just cash in all my cards and just go for it. Um, <clears throat> it's brave if you're interested in the residential course because it's tough, okay? It is seven days of intense one-on-one -on -one training. That's a lot of what you'll not find with a lot of other uh, pickup events and everything like that. The instructors that are available here, okay, are, in all honesty, they're the best at what they do. This isn't like a pickup gimmick to them. These are guys that are good. These are normal people, all right? These are normal guys with a healthy social life. They have women in their life. Um, and when you go with them, they're very demonstrative. They have no problem doing what they just ask you to do. And most of all, there's not a lot of issues with them doing success with it. In fact, 95% of the time, it was smooth. Then you've got Kezia. She, she doesn't really require any introduction. Uh, she is honestly like one of the best instructors in the pickup community by far. Uh, the one-on-one -on -one training that I did with her at the beginning of the course was simply phenomenal. Then you have some of the other instructors, her sister, Edessa, she's also an exceptional instructor. She can give you different variations of how to approach, you know, pick up. Uh, you have Chloe, she's a you know, tall Eastern European girl, very party girl, she knows how to do that aspect of game, you know, you have like the different yings and yangs of game and everything, that's a good thing. It's not just indirect, it's also direct, party goers, you know, cafe girls. Another great thing about this course is that they have a fashion expert, one of the best, and he goes and he'll take you to each store and he'll work within the means of your budget and he'll find you what's right for your complexion, body style, etc. Uh, it goes without saying, I don't have to elaborate anymore on him, where I had club promoters and club owners coming up to me stating, giving me compliments on my attire. This is something that has never happened to me before in my life, so I remember it pretty vividly. It was pretty cool. I mean, I'm just some new guy in this club, and then there's this club promoter that's surrounded by women and has his own table, and this is his job, coming up asking me, you know, where did I get that blazer, you know, where did I get that outfit, who hooked me up with it, etc. and so on. So, that's that in a nutshell. Overall, with the results, uh, I can honestly say that I'm really, really surprised and also really, really happy with everything that's happened so far. Naturally, it's seven days of day, night, day, night, so it's really, really tough. You, you really have to come here committed with a drive. If you're kind of halfway about it, just don't bother. You know, they only take very committed students, to be honest with you. Um, 
I went from a guy, I'm not going to give you a you know, big sob story, I went from a guy that was lucky to have one girl romantically interested in me to several. Alright, I, I got to fly back next Wednesday and I'm trying to like schedule and plan out like where I'm going to take the girls, where we're going to go and stuff like that, so it's cool. Something that I should you know, brush up on real quick is that the, the course obviously happens here in London and it's worth it coming here because not only is London a place that's, you know, very historical, et cetera, and so on, but this is the fashion and modeling capital of basically Europe. Some of the most beautiful women in Europe all come here with, you know, the expectations of getting into the fashion, modeling, dancing industry. A, uh, a girl I met, a dancer, was from Australia, and she actually came here from there in order to start her dancing career. So, it's good to mention that it's, you're not just coming from the course, you're just also coming from London because there's a lot that the city offers you that you might, will not get anywhere else in any other city. Alright, so that's about it to sum it up. I mean, in conclusion, you're going to be a skeptical guy and everything. And, but in all honesty, just, you know, give it a shot. I can honestly say after these seven days that I've done some incredible things. I am completely exhausted. There's a part of me that's kind of happy it's, it's done with. I'd, I'd like to get a little bit of a break. But now I'm starting to get the tick where, okay, I want to start going out again. But just, just go for it. Don't freaking toy around with the idea or anything like that. Just, the results you're going to get, you're not going to get anywhere else. You know, you're not going to get the one-on-one -on -one tutelage that you can. So they give you top priority over everyone else. You can clearly see that. When they get a residential student, like I was like king student. There wasn't a single thing. There was one instructor and we were joking with Kezia and we told her that the instructor wasn't going to make it. And she stopped everything. She was actually going out that evening. She stopped everything, canceled her taxi reservation, canceled everything, got another instructor out of nowhere. You can tell that she has like a little bit of command with her instructors. <laughs> Got a, for lack of a better term, she's going kind of by the balls. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. And uh, she got like another instructor. And this was literally within like two minutes. Like, we, me and James had just done the joke. We're like, oh, we'll screw with Kezia a little bit. And within like two minutes, she was like, called me back. And she's like, okay, he is fired. He is all this other stuff. He's like, I have another instructor coming there right now. I will be there in a few minutes. And I was like, Oh my god, like I told the instructor, James, and he was like, oh shit, <laughs> I'm screwed. So, yeah, in all honesty, they, uh, they drop everything to really help you and cater to your goals and to you as a person. But that's about all I got. Uh, my name's Rob. Take it easy.